I was working with, um, oh gosh, it was um, Trojan Women, and I was playing Helen of Troy. I think the direct, the designer was Murray Lawfer, I think. Right. And gosh, was that a famous, famous? Yep. Yeah. Yep. And um, there was an amazing cutter at um, Canadian stage. Oh, it wasn't, what was it called then? All those incarnations, Can stage, blah, blah, blah. Um, Center stage um, called Sophie, and I can't remember her last name. But oh, Sophie! Sophie oh, wow. yes. So, so Murray Lawford showed me this backless Helen of Troy, halfway down my showing, like a good degree of, of, of what can you say butt crack for the Theatre Museum of Canada, and cleavage. Um, uh, butt cleavage, and um, Murray Lawford left the room, and Sophie saw the look of alarm on my face, and she said, "Don't worry, we will fix." It. And so, you know, whatever Murray wanted, she, you know, took about half of it away and nobody said anything. But that's what you, you know, you could say, does it really have to be? Does it, could we? But at know? no point, so th this is me expressing my amazement. At no point does the designer who's there and the cutter and they're doing the fitting talk Collaborate. to the actress and saying, so how's it going in rehearsal? What, what's developing? We're thinking about this. Does this um, actually fit with you, where you think this character is the, going? The schedule simply doesn't work that way. Those decisions, the thing, the costume is being cut. Now, hopefully, it used to be it was cut in toile, and then they would remake it. They don't cut in toile anymore. They cut in, you know, they cut in the original fabric. So that happens early on. And, and so, I mean, if you've got sort of, a choice of sweaters. I mean, because the point is, when you're making decisions, you're in uh, in that way. You're in sort of week two, and those decisions have pretty much been made. Um, but can't you say like? Well, I'm big on scene... footwear. I'm big on footwear. So very early on, I do kind of state my preferences about how I need to feel in the footwear, because. You know, I come from a time when they used to make your boots, you know, and now it's tender tootsies the best there are, you know.